What's going on YouTube? This is over Spider Spider Tumblr's coming back at you with another mail call video. So today's mail call video is going to be a pacer adventure challenge. I know I've showed a couple of them off here, um, but I believe that's going to be my last one for a little while. We got two short box purchases. I was able to get to these from the last video because you noticed I had Gabe's cave uh, loot box unboxing. So that took a while and that was a lot of stuff in there. So uh, this is another day now, so we're gonna go ahead and open up the, the two short box purchases and a Pacer Adventure Challenge. So, like my other videos in the past, I will start off with them first. Uh, as everybody knows by now, I have been on a little weight loss journey, and Pacer Adventure Challenge has, has made it a little bit more fun for me to do. Keep in mind, I have now been going on for a few uh trips without actually purchasing one i need to get back on it so hopefully i'll be able to do some more here soon but we're opening up the box there's the inside <laughs> oh and this is iceland log lagav gore this was right now has been my biggest uh mileage or longest miles so far um I was just talking about that in another video saying how I needed to actually uh, try to go for the longer ones because I'm doing the mileage and not getting the rewards for it. But this, look at this, this is nice. This was a 50 mile one, uh, Iceland. There you go, that's the back of it. Uh, I almost wanna say this is kind of like a glow in the dark, but I'm not sure. Give me one sec, I'm gonna try something. All right, so what happened is I actually stopped the video. I'm gonna try to pause it, so give me one sec again. I'm gonna try it. All right, so the reason I wanted to pause it because this metal is glow in the dark. That is amazing. That is beautiful. So let me go ahead and pause it, again, uh, pause it and I'm gonna go back to turning on the lights. So there you go. That was my 50 mile Iceland. That is amazing. So like on all my other videos, let's go ahead and try this bad boy on. So there we go. There is my 50 mile Iceland, oh, sorry, metal. I'm kind of short, so I'm tippy toeing. But again, like I said, this one here has been the furthest one that I have done, which is gonna be a 50 mile. I'm gonna start doing a lot more of these uh, longer miles because I'm starting to run out of the short ones. This thing was nice because it's still glowing. If I do this, I can see the, the green tint to it. There you go. Um, but real nice. I like the black color to it. Everything about it is just amazing. So I'm going to start looking at some of the longer miles because that's what I have left to do. And I'm going to go little by little. I don't remember how, exactly how long this one took me to do. But if it's 50 miles, you're looking at maybe... I do six, seven miles a day, so maybe a six, seven mile, uh, six, seven day journey. I will do it. Uh, I will be posting a photo of the certificate along here on the side so you guys can kind of see that, but Pacer Adventure Challenge. So I'll keep this on the side because I'll do my little recap. Let's go ahead and move on to the short box purchases I did. So this is going to be two purchases. Let's see what I got. All right, so on this one, I'm gonna put this box here on the side. So I'm gonna throw the other box right inside. So they went with postal wrap packaging for everything. I will save these bubble wrap mailers. Well, at least the ones that are salvageable. So there's the book. There's some more mailers. There we go. Inside a mailer. All right. So I have purchased this from this guy in the past. So it does have a thank you note here. And when you buy these things from Shortbox, you, you really don't know who the seller is. Uh, you would obviously, Penguin Comics, I did purchase some more from him before. It says, thank you for the repeat business. But 
if you have a few different things on there that are almost like these these uh, Dell publishings is what I'm eh, is what I'm trying to collect here is a lot of these maybe 5.50 and above. So I was really liking the Porky Pig covers, and I got myself another one. It's a Porky Pig number 56. But a lot of these, if you see these random ones, the, the seller may be the same person. So if there's like 10 of these, the good possibility the 10 are probably owned from the same guy. So let's go ahead and do that as a screenshot and see what it looks like. Click, click, boom. So that's Porky Pig number 56. So another journey of collecting that I'm going into, but not not just any cover. I have to actually like the cover so that to me it stands out. Not too much going on there, not too crazy. Gives me that nice old feel to it, but something that I'm interested in collecting. So I will move on forward with it and keep collecting. Why does it seem like my camera's a little higher? Oh, oh, oh. All right, so let's try it there. So, box number two from Shortbox. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> Newspaper. I always love seeing the trash thrown inside these things. All right, so here we go. Some newspaper wrapping, newspaper, 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 and some more newspaper. Let's see what I got here. You can't see. Okay, so this is another oldie but a goodie. Probably no interest to a lot of other people, but it caught my eye. Just <laughs> so it's a 6.5. This is Faucets Funny Animals number four. 57 from 1947 so keep in mind this is 1947 and a 6.5 that is amazing obviously the color is a little tan but another reason i picked this up is a uk edition so faucet families l miller and sons is the publications from 1947 faucet funnies <laughs> so we got uh, like a super rabbit. Let's see. Frosted Funnies, Animals, World's Mightiest Bunny. Oh, this thing is just amazing. Just wonderful. Actually, I'm going to make this one my screenshot. Porky Pig. You know, actually, you know what? I actually like them both, so I can't. There we go. Porky Pig and Frosted Funny. Click, click, boom. So there's the back. Little melodies. Willie song. <laughs> Sing to the tune of Mistress Mary. Willie, he's a fishing. Willie's fishing <laughs> that he could catch a whale. My name's, I'm not even going to sing because that is a lot. There we go. That's what the back of these things look like. But Faucet Funnies, Porky Pig. That is going to be my unboxing video for the day. So that was my recap kind of. You see the two older books. One's from 1947. The other is from 1958. Uh, really really excited to have these in the collection I'm glad that I'm going a different route with some of the stuff that I'm collecting um, but yeah that faucet funnies being a UK edition was really nice Put that back in the baggie and one more and of course my pacer adventure glow in the dark metal so that was neat to see. I already liked the way it looked. And then it come out to be glow in the dark. So that was even better. So that's going to do it for this unboxing video. It was going to be real short. Keep in mind, we got giveaways going along, uh, going on. So in the video description down below, I will put video links to that video. Uh, you're going to see like hashtag tumblers, hashtag something, something. Just enter that hashtag in the video description and you will be entered to win. But other than that, just leave me a comment down below. I should have done that first. Sorry about that. Leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think about these older books, my Pacer Adventure Challenges. Obviously, this was a short video, but I'm really excited about those. And again, if you guys can do me another favor, hit that like. Uh, can you? Okay, let me let me breathe a little. Now, if you guys can all do me another favor, please hit that like button. Give me a thumbs up. 
Subscribe if you guys haven't already subscribed and please hit that little notification bell so that you guys can get notified with all the upcoming videos like the giveaways and such and such. But until then, everybody, like always, please stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you guys on the next one.